Have you ever heard of the IPCC? Sir, have you ever heard of the IPCC? Do you think that's an authoritative body? So what does the Intergovernmental Panel on Climate Change say from the UN? Well, don't forget, they are a government panel, a political panel, not scientists. What they say and the data they have are two different things. Now I'm going to use this report. You want references. It's table 1212, and that's why I couldn't answer this gentleman's question over there before, because I was dealing with it. But table 1212, page 1856, the latest report from the IPCC. And it's a table, and down this column, this column is about where they happen to be able to detect no signal at all from man affecting these things. Yes? So where you've got a white block, where you've got a white cell, there's no signal. Right? Hard to read, so I'm going to list them for you now in the video. Okay? So no trace of from mankind historically with frost, mean precipitation, that's rainfall, river floods, heavy rainfall, that's heavy precipitation, pluvial floods, that's urban floods in cities, etc., landslides, aridity, that's very dry air, hydrological droughts, agricultural and ecological drought, fire weather, that's conditions for forest fires, wind speed, severe windstorms, tropical cyclones, that's hurricanes, etc., sand and dust storms, snow, glacier and ice sheets, heavy snowfall and ice storm, hail, snow avalanche, coastal sea flood, coastal flood, coastal erosion, marine heat waves and ocean acidity, air pollution and last of all, weather radiation at the surface. So, with all of those, there is no evidence whatsoever to date of mankind having influenced on all those characteristics with the climate. But what do they claim we have interfered with? Now let's take a look at that. So they claim there are differences in the heat and cold section, I'll go into detail soon, snow and ice section, and open ocean section. Let's take a look at the actual list where the differences are. So this is where they found evidence in the historic record of mankind interfering with it. Of course, any change has to be down to mankind. They found it in mean air temperature, extreme heat, cold spell, permafrost. So, so far, all those are related to temperature, the permafrost melting, etc. There, Lake, river and sea ice, not ocean, but lake, river and sea ice, mean ocean um, temperature, ocean salinity and dissolved oxygen. Now, the key here is that all of those are related to one thing, change. That's changes in temperature. OK, cut it short now. So uh, the IPCC agree in the data. So how the hell do they issue and everyone scare everyone for all those things? Because 